All right, we're back with another video of the ZR2. Uh, I was hoping to have a really exciting video on the truck today, but instead it's going to turn into more of an informative video of something that I learned, have experienced, and am currently going over. So I was going to have a surprise and have installed Amp Research Extreme Side Steps. As you can see, no side steps. The reason for that is because I ordered them. I talked to the company that I ordered them from. They told me that they would fit. They would work. I told them that it was a 2022 Chevy Silverado ZR2. Um, they checked their configuration supposedly and said, oh, it works just fine. I would be okay ordered them um, given my busy work schedule I was unable to do any type of installations myself so I took them in to get done now with doing so the people who installed them they were very nice to me um, worked on it and they just couldn't get them to work they got them to cycle one time that was it they called amp research themselves and in doing so uh amp research said oh well unfortunately the new electronics in the new refresh silverado trucks uh does not work or coincide or is not compatible with the current electronic brain if you will for the amp research steps so they told me that basically i have to have it uninstalled off my truck send it back in yada yada so then i got a hold of the company that i went with and talked to them and currently there's an ongoing ordeal with them where i'm having some issues with them as well but um Hopefully everything gets resolved between that company and myself and we will see what happens and I can give a further update on that later. Now with that being said, I will say to anybody out there who is wondering about the AMP research steps, uh, putting them on the new 2022 refreshed models, AMP research did say yes, it is coming. Uh, I spoke with them myself. They said probably a month or two months from now they will have all the new electronic updates in their system for their steps and they will be able to sell it specifically for these newer models because clearly there's a lot of electronics going on here um so they said they're hoping about a month to two months and they'll be able to have those on the market for any of those of you out there who are wondering or are in question or maybe wanting to get them now I will say with the steps on the truck, even though how they work, they are beautiful steps. They are awesome steps. It's just a very unfortunate event that it did not work. Um, but I don't want to bring everything to a halt in this video. So I will say that I did get um, a console safe. So I did get the console safe installed in the truck um very happy to have that in here myself personally um let me get this open here move some stuff out of the way so pretty spacious fairly deep cushion in the bottom um very easy installation basically you got the console safe here obviously before it's in here a couple screws in here that you gotta pull this up you can see bolt there bolt there that's literally all it does there's a, a bottom plastic piece in the bottom of your console when it comes that plastic piece comes up and out these come out put the safe in put the bolts in this little exterior strip right around here and then you put your little foam insert in and then you can put whatever you want in there um money if you want to carry your money around or for those of you who are pro firearm pro gun whatever you'd like to call it put those in there put your safe in i will say this when you turn it all the way over it doesn't like 
to turn very well so you have to kind of get it in the middle and then they will rotate so, but if you go all the way over to the left they just don't like to move very well for some reason but all in all it's sturdy it's secure it's in there and it's working so i'm happy with it um all right we'll go over uh, a couple more things so far with the truck obviously just over 500 miles right now um i realize it says 13.6 fuel economy that's not actually accurate that's just what it's telling me based off my fill up i'm actually getting roughly around 16 ish miles a gallon right now um closer to that 17 range uh, i still like to keep my foot in the throttle but hey i mean it's still new um i haven't actually got to take it off-road off-road yet but um obviously the screen is amazing and nice still uh i wouldn't say hardcore off-road but i have had it off-road in general um the suspension feels good um so far doing what you know everybody's read about on it i mean it's smooth for what it is for being off-road it's not very hard very rugged on your on you um and then like i said for 500 miles it being a new truck you know maybe maybe it's still the placebo effect of it being new maybe not um you know the more miles i get on it the more i get to take it out and play with it you know the better it'll be but until i get those miles on there and i get it going i guess we'll just never know for the time being until we get there but for those of you who stuck around watch this video in its entirety um hopefully it helps you as far as making a decision with your side steps maybe amp research is not the way you want to go maybe it's too pricey for you or or maybe you just like the standardized ones better I, I don't know but i know there's a lot of people out there that do um like amp research steps and they do um like knowing the new things that are coming out and if companies are going to progress with it which we all know that a lot of times they're going to because that's how they're going to make their money but just this way you guys have a little bit of education and information on the current situation so if this is something you are looking into right now don't order them yet wait until you actually see on the amp research website that it says that it's going to fit this specific model um you know don't do what i did and don't take someone else's word for it and go ahead and order it and end up in the position that i'm currently in but thank you all um sincerely for your time for watching this video because i mean in the end result i'm a nobody I, i'm not a big famous youtuber i work a full-time job just like 99 percent of all of the rest of you people who are watching this video um i'm just putting this out there for you guys yeah, I'm trying to give you guys a little bit of information. I know a lot of people are wanting to see things on this truck or wanting to see uh, things that people are doing to these trucks. And, you know, if I can help bring that insight to you guys, great. Um, but if this video has helped anybody in any way or you know that it would help any of your friends in any way who's thinking about putting these steps on their trucks, please, please share this information with them. Get it out there to them. Let them know. Um, like I said, I'm a nobody on here. I'm just doing this because I like doing this. So, you know, thank you for your time of watching it. Um, if you wouldn't mind hitting the like button or subscribing, I am going to have more videos coming out. I would greatly appreciate that. But until next time, thank you guys. I appreciate it. And be safe.